YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy Urban Minds Inc. representing, man. You know, it's Sunday, ain't got much to do. I'm just uh, out working on the car, man, fixing some things around the house. You know, I'm very fortunate and blessed to be able to call myself a jack of all trades. But one thing about that is, you know, with being a jack of all trades and being willing to dive in the different tasks that are unknown that you do not know much about is you save money in the end and you gain knowledge. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of, you know, men out there that uh, fear that they will mess something up if they try to do something that they never do. You know, um, just a couple couple months back, man, I was looking to have a, a slab of concrete poured in my backyard. And, um, you know, when I was getting quotes, quotes were as high as $2,000 and the lowest one was $1,600. But once I uh, watched a couple videos and did my research and used different uh, uh, square foot calculators and things like that, man, I did research and I was able to go to Home Depot and Lowe's, price out the material, price out the uh, machinery that I would have to rent. Man, you gotta excuse me, man. I'm getting used to this uh, this permanent retainer, man. So if I look like I'm talking like a 90 year old man, that's why. But um, once I priced it out, had some coworkers that uh, that were willing to help me. Two coworkers, men, man. We put our hands together, and um, probably for about less than $800, I was able to lay a bigger portion, a bigger slab of concrete than if somebody would have came out and laid it for me because the, the size that they quoted me for was a smaller slab. But doing it myself, being a jack of all trades, I was able to save some money and get a bigger piece of uh, patio laid that I now barbecue on, uh, my kids play on, just having a, you know, a good quality time on. You know, the most important thing is I will never pay to have that done unless it's just out of my, my scope as far as, uh, you know, it requires too many people for me to get it done. But if it's a, a small project and I can do it like I did this one, then I save some money. You know, when it comes to home plumbing, you know, I didn't know anything about that, but I just got into it. And uh, when I had a leak and learned a little bit about that, go to Home Depot, ask people, ask the people that work there about what you're trying to do. Working on cars is uh, something that I've used countless times and it's came in clutch. You know what I'm saying? It's being a jack of all trades, but don't be afraid to explore tasks that you think are hard or, uh, you know, unachievable for you because there is, man, you got YouTube, you got Google. If you want to know how to do something, you can do it. Um, you know, there's just so many resources and answers out there to help you do what you want to do. So don't ever be afraid to become a jack of all trades and save yourself some money and gain some knowledge, man. That's just the uh, the message of the day. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Holler back at your boy. Peace.